Hey everybody, I just wanted to share with you what I'm reading in Ephesians. Um, if you want to read the whole book of Ephesians, if your Bible doesn't have <clears throat> kind of like the introduction on the front of it, try to find you a Bible that has it because it's really helpful. It kind of sums up what the book is about. So my my newer Bible doesn't have what this old Bible has. This is an old, old Bible. So for the book of Ephesians, it says, Ephesians is dressed to a group of believers who are rich beyond measure in Jesus Christ, yet living as beggars, and only because they are ignorant of their wealth. Paul begins to de begins by describing in chapters 1 through 3 the contents of the Christian's heavenly bank account. Adoption, acceptance, redemption, forgiveness, wisdom, inheritance, the seal of the Holy Spirit, life, grace, citizenship, in short, every spiritual blessing. In chapters 4 through 6, the Christians learn the Christian learns a spiritual walk rooted in the spiritual well, for we are his workmanship created in Christ Jesus, that's one through three, unto good works, that we should walk in them, four through six. And I'm in chapter three, and what pops out to me on the page, I mean, it all is popping out to me, but what pops out to me on the page is verse four that says, whereby when ye read, ye may understand my knowledge in the mystery of Christ. If you are not reading God's word, you will not understand the knowledge and the mysteries of Jesus. So it's important that you pick up this Bible and read it. Even if you don't understand it, you may have to read it several times over. And don't forget, get you a notepad, get you um, some highlighters, get your pen and write it down and call it out to yourself because I've read this over and over and it wasn't highlighted in my Bible. So uh, at that time, it was not popping out to me. So I want to encourage you, keep reading, abiding in the Lord. It means exactly that. Always be hungering and thirsty after Jesus, okay? So I'm going to keep reading. I hope you pick up your Bible and read to Ephesians. It's only six chapters and it tells us who we are and it tells us, y'all, it's so encouraging. So pick it up and read it. Bye.